my tips on compassion. The problem with compassion is it may feel that if you give compassion to someone else who doesn't understand it or maybe you may think they don't deserve it because they may be rejecting it or they may treat you like uh, a doormat it may feel like a weakness and that's one problem with compassion that people say uh, the people I work with they say that uh, that may happen so my answer to this is the following before you can give compassion to others cultivate self-compassion self-compassion is a wish for kindness wish for the pain and suffering be reduced for yourself and why does that make you more stronger in giving compassion to others think about it when you take care of yourself and you have a certain confidence and a certain kindness a kind nature which includes you your bucket will be filled you will have the oxygen mask on your own nose and then it will be easier for you to take care of the baby next to you also it's about the way your own brain will be developed in experiencing kindness so when you see others suffering it will be more natural for the compassion to arise in your heart in some sense compassion is a core value compassion we need to make a commitment to compassion when we make a commitment to compassion and we are having a hard time experiencing compassion for someone you may have to struggle a little bit you may have to redirect with deliberation the idea that just what I want the other person wants the same thing just like I want comfort I want reduction in my suffering the other person wants the same thing and this idea this interpretation of compassion really helps to understand maybe that other person's side so practice this and see what comes up for you